Looks like it's gonna clear it. We're just now leaving the tunnel and entering the brand new city of Erlengrat. That's right, boys. We left America and we came to uh, to all these mountains. You guys can see if you check it out, just beautiful scenery all around. And uh, we decided to spend some money and buy another villa and build that on top of a mountain. I think it's pretty cool. We're living dangerously as always. But look at the landscapes. We're on the brand new Alpine Farming uh, expansion DLC for Farming Simulator, and uh, it's a really cool. There's our buddy Spencer TV. He's got his G portal sign up there. But we're gonna check out the city before we head on up to uh, our brand new villa on the mountain. The thing is absolutely insane. Uh, and I mean, I can't even wait to check it out. It's crazy. It's got the best landscape you could ever possibly see. I'm getting used to these roads. I mean, it's very, very different. I don't know. I think they drive on the right side here. That's a supermarket. That's pretty cool. So we can buy some uh, fillets if we're uh, getting hungry or anything else like that. So <laughs> very tight corners too. Oh boy. Yeah, they do drive on the right side. Look at that. All right, let's take this roundabout, and then we're going to head up to this hotel. Uh, it's like a 300-room hotel. It's like a billion-dollar hotel or something. So we're going to check that out. Forgot to say, if you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to smash that like button. And uh, subscribe if you guys are new. We just passed 11,000 subscribers yesterday, so that's crazy. All right, how am I supposed to get up to that hotel? You guys can see it all the way up there. Oh, gosh, we're getting chased by uh, some European vehicle. It's a European Subaru, boss. Go around the roundabout. Loop around. Yes, sir, Lamborghini. Got the North Point camper. So we had to sleep somewhere on the way over. Oh, boy. Popping wheelers. Dude. Oh, took that one out. Oh, my gosh. These signs. Oh, I took a third one out. These signs are crazy. How am I supposed to not hit them? All right, here we go. Full speed, boys. We'll send it. But, yeah, we're going to buy some supercars, too. We got uh, some Bentleys and stuff like that. They said they have a, a lot full of these supercars. So we'll have to check those out. I think it's right up here. There we go. Now we know where we're going. Jeez, how are you supposed to fit two cars between this? I can get the camper barely in between. Oh boy. Sharp turn. I plan to do a bunch of more recordings on this map. It's uh, it's European, but it's very, very cool. Uh, the city of Erlengrat. I think that's how you pronounce it. Erlengrat or Erlengrat? One of the two. Yes, sir. This would be a cool map for camping, too. Maybe we'll have to uh, go luxury camping on it. I mean, that would be fun. Oh my gosh, the roads are thin. Slow down. Alright, well, the European series says that apparently this road will take us there. Uh, or we're going to a completely dangerous wood. Okay, well, European Siri apparently says that this road will take us to that hotel to check it out. But, uh, I, I don't know, man. I mean, it's, it's getting pretty scary in here. Alright, I'm pretty sure this is the first time Siri hasn't lied to me uh, when we're getting map directions. Because I think this is it. Oh my goodness, it's got 24 karat gold awnings. That's sweet. What, do we just valet our Lambo and camper here? There we go. Okay, we'll valet that, and they'll take care of us. Should be good. Let's go over to here. Oh, boy. Look at the city. That is sweet. Oh, my gosh. This is so cool. I like it a lot. That's awesome. So, look at the city. We can uh, see a lot of everything. This is the hotel. 300 plus bedrooms. And then, what are these? These might be more rooms, too. I think these are office spaces. Yeah, check that out. 3D and everything. They went all out on this hotel. Alright, how are we going to turn around this, uh, this Lamborghini here? Hold on. I think we can do it. Alright, don't touch anything. We don't want to take out any 24 Gary Gold. Okay, back it up. Back it up. Looks good. Alright. Alright, we're good. We're good. We cleared it. Oh, wrong way. Alright, well, let's go to our mountain villa. I want to check that thing out a lot. I think it's not too far. It should be right, uh, right up the road, actually, because this is the, uh, the billionaire's uh, mountain. So, pretty cool mountain, I think. Alright, we're gonna go down here. We gotta go back through the city, and then uh, it's right, should be right on the other side. Yes, sir. 80 miles per hour through a uh, European city. Oh my gosh. Hopefully the police don't come after us. Alright, well, this is the road. This is how we kind of get up there. It's very tight. Oh gosh, let's try not to hit this car. Alright, I don't know how much farther it is. It should be right up the road here. Alright, and then we had to come back down to the main road, and then there's a super cool uh, blue lagoon kind of water river so that's really cool and then here it is guys the mountain villa check it out so we kind of go up this cobblestone driveway which is a very nice touch and then we have these uh the shrubs that are really cool so here let's go ahead pull in here look at that precision right there all right let's pull in park the camper up pull it in here for now we should be good right there perfect that's pretty sweet north point camper we got the eagle htx in there and oh my gosh, we built another one of these boys. We already have a, a luxury villa, but that one is $8 million. Guess how much this one cost, guys? This villa was $11 million to build. Now, you're probably wondering, like, what? How is it $11 million? So, 
basically the last one only cost eight million because the land was a million and then the building was seven million so that's eight million this one costs seven million to build and then it costs us four million for the land because it's in the mountain so very cool house i think you guys have already checked it out for those that haven't seen it i'm gonna go in real quick go through a quick walkthrough and we already made a video on this one lava lamp we got a very modern kitchen modern kind of dining table very cool we got a luxury garage and workout room over here check that out Treadmill, Peloton, get everything. Right, let's head up the stairs. There's a couple bedrooms I want to show you guys. Another fireplace right there. Perfect. You got a bathroom here. Ooh, walk-in closet, master bedroom. And look at these views. We can kind of have our own waterfall. Very nice views. Got some deer on the wall. Some uh, some art. So uh, over here, got another bedroom. This is uh, guest bedroom number one. So when you have friends over, you can stay there. And then we have another bedroom too, which is cool. Super weird seats out there. But I heard they're comfortable, so that's good. We have our, our palette for painting and our, our poster, so we can just paint. I don't know, I guess the mountains. Yeah, I guess that's our plan. Okay, I'm going to start drawing, and I'll see you guys as soon as I finish the poster. How's that look, boys? Yes, sir. Oh, my gosh. Well, let's get moving on here, and uh, let's go check out the outside. I think this is a little different than the other one because we have the mountains. Back here, we have the Blue Lagoon. Uh, we can probably go swimming in it, and then we have a patio furniture. What's next on today's plan is to buy some supercars. We got to pick up a Bentley and a Ford GT from the dealership, drive those boys back, and uh, we're going to have some fun with those as soon as we get on the road. So I'm going to go ahead and take a taxi on over to the dealership and uh, pick up the first one. All right, the taxi just dropped us off at this location. They said uh, this is called the lot in quotation marks, and uh, they said our vehicles are around here somewhere. Here they are. We have a Bentley Moliner. This thing is a convertible. It's really cool. We got it in red. I think the color looks great. Great choice. And then the 4 GT. We have it in a, uh, a darker kind of blue. Very cool color. Carbon fiber accents. And uh, we got this thing actually imported uh, for the dealership. Uh, I think we have something else. No, not those two. Oh, there it is. You probably couldn't have missed it when it came in. Uh, 39 Contender. We have like five of these over in America. So we had this one shipped over for us. Uh, that we're going to do some boating because if you guys check it out, there is a lake. Got the drone in the air. So they have a gigantic lake as you guys can see. And just look at the overhead view. The train over there, we might have to go check that out. And uh, we got, I don't know what's up there, a government facility. And there's chairlifts for uh, for skiing too. So it must be a ski mountain on the other side. And uh, very cool. I love this map guys. It's so relaxing. And I bet you guys are enjoying it too. Let's bring the drone back home. Drop it down, there we go. Perfect, let's disengage it there. All right, drone's back on the ground, here we are, hello. So, we're gonna take these three back. I think we meant to bring the Lambo to bring this thing and tow it back, and then uh, let's take them on over. So we'll start with the Ford, and then we'll come back for the other two. Oh, yes sir, we already know what these things run like. Very hot and fast. All right, look like the road barriers are coming up from the train. Perfect, come on, beat the Subaru. All right, there we go, and then the next road is ours, it takes us up to the uh, the house. Oh yes, these roads are so nice and paved, so uh, they work really good. The drop off lot's pretty close, so not far away. Looking good, looking minty. Let's lock it here. Let's go grab the uh, the Bentley, and then we'll bring it back. Yes sir, I love the thing. This is going to be our Sunday cruiser. This is how we're going to get back and forth from the supermarket. Uh, well, maybe we might use a, a truck for that, but... Uh, this thing is definitely a Sunday driver. Get some air in the face. And it's fast too. Check this out. Reaching speeds 100 already. Yes sir, drifting there. <laughs> oh boy. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Drift it. Oh gosh. That was not a good drift. I love this driveway too. The cobblestone really brings out the, uh, brings out the contrast. Okay, right there should be good for now. Bentley, all set, parked up. And then uh, let's grab the Lambo. We gotta detach it from this thing. All right, back it up. There's not much space in here, but we'll uh, we'll make it work. Camper's good, so that's good. That's how we got to this place. So now let's go pick up the boat. Right, and roundabout. Oh boy, we didn't take that. We didn't turn at all on that one. All right, back up, nice and easy. And then we'll get all the hoses attached. But we're gonna have to lower that thing a lot. All right, bring the jack stand up. Perfect. Is electrical? No, we don't have any electrical for this trailer. All right, we're good to go. Oh, it tows it just fine. I'm surprised the Lamborghini can tow this uh, 20,000 pound beast. Okay, nice and slow. Don't want to go uh, pop some wheelies because that'll bottom this thing out. But what I am going to do is go around this roundabout. All right, easy, easy. Oh boy, don't hit the pole, don't hit the pole. No, no, no. Okay, we're good, we're good. 
Alright, there we go. Taking a right, and then... I think we gotta take a right. There's Spencer. Just past Spencer TV sign. I'll take another left. I'm surprised there aren't too many uh, electrical lines. I mean, we had to take a different route because the electrical lines, which should be good. As long as we watch the street lights, we're basically golden. Should have no problems. It hasn't touched anything yet. Alright, we're back at the house. All right, let's pull over to the right here, and then we'll back it in. Back the boat in the back. Uh, back the boat in the back. Alright, this gate's tight. We gotta keep it nice and slow. Okay, there we go. This thing's actually gigantic. Crank it over. Don't hit the Bentley. We're good, we're good, we're still good. Start cranking. There we go, perfect. Okay, I think we got all of our prize possessions in here. Let's go ahead and lock up the security gate. No one's coming in today. Now, let's see uh, how well we did. Make sure the motors aren't in the rocks. Okay, we're good on that side. Ooh, we just made it on that one. About an inch away, perfect. Lamborghinis are good, and uh, I'm kind of zoomed in right now. It kind of looks like really cool, because you guys can better see it on those that are on mobile. So I'm kind of trying something different to see what it looks like. So you can kind of see the video is a little bit zoomed in, but it looks cool. It's a little bit high definition, so that's awesome. We're just waiting for our pit bull to get on over to Europe, and then uh, we'll have our buddy with us. Hopefully, you guys, uh, had a great time watching today's video. Uh, it's going to end it here, but uh, we're all settled in at the Mountain Villa. That's right, so very cool Mountain Villa, and uh, I had fun making today's video. Definitely a fun one, different map, and I love this Alpine DLC. Pick it up if you guys haven't already. Um, I have a link down below. Yes, I'm, uh, I'm going to probably go check out the ski resort. So hopefully you guys had a great time watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.